United Nations, the role of the United Nations in climate change and, and discussions, uh, that goes back to how we think about climate change. Climate change is, a, is a, a, a tragedy of the commons issue and thinking around tragedy of the commons goes back way back to the early 1800s when in England uh, there was a concern about overgrazing of commons pasture land. People would she uh, graze their sheep on the pasture land and, uh, and there was concern that the, the pasture would disappear altogether. So somebody said, well, I'm not gonna graze my sheep there. And the problem was if their next door neighbor increased the amount of grazing of their sheep on the, on the land, uh, the problem wasn't solved, but only the first farmer who didn't graze their sheep there was hurt. Same thing with, with climate change. Climate change is a global co commons problem. And that's why it needs the United Nations and the United Nations had made, has made ma several efforts to do so. The first effort, uh, was the Kyoto Protocol, which was an effort to regulate uh, globally uh, climate issues. And uh, it was essentially a failure. Uh, it was agreed in the 1990s, and then upon that agreement, uh, first of all, the United Nations, uh, sorry, the United States opted not to, um, uh, to ratify the, uh, the Kyoto Protocol. Canada, in turn, did ratify it, but uh, opted not to execute on it. And other countries then dragged their heels and, uh, and, and nothing was done about it. And so the Kyoto Protocol was essentially a failure.